and welcome back to McGinn's Woodshop. Uh, today I just want to show you some very exciting stuff I've learned with the X-Curve. It's uh, how to 3D curve and how to V-curve. I'm not going to show you how, I'm just going to show um, the process and uh, you can watch it actually happen. And if you want to know exactly how to do V-cuts and stuff on the X-Curve, uh, let me know in the comments and I'll uh, consider putting out a video on the complete setup and overview of all this stuff. So for this guy here, uh, there's some 3D curving involved uh, for the scroll and the backdrop and then there's V curving and something called uh, prism curving but I'm not really sure exactly what that meant uh, but it did give the result of the V curve look for the uh, logo that I was looking for so that worked out well. And I'm really pleased with those results. This here is the result of V curving uh, and then using the flat back options where I can clear out the back and uh, clear out all the most of the waste and then come over with the V bit and do the V curving so everything pops out as opposed to going in. So it's just an opposite way of doing it and I've also did that on this block of spalted maple for make the first cut. Um, I also did the inset V carving. So anyway, I won't hold you any longer. Let's go ahead and watch uh, my sign get cut out here and you can see the action. And I hope you enjoy the show. <laughs> 